Thank you. I'll continue with the literary theme that I started with the first song about the Bronte sisters. I've always fancied myself as a bit of a lady Victorian novelist myself. And I've written a song which I think if Jane Austen were alive today and were to write a country and western song, this is the sort of song she would write. You know, I was brought up on Pride and Prejudice, Sense and Sensibility, Best and Bestiality, all those books I've written them on. And uh, this is my uh, related tribute to Jane. It's a song of unrequited love and just deserts. And it's called, and I'm re we're recording it tonight, I hope, because I've yet to put this on it is, uh, and it's called She Nailed My Heart to the Kitchen Door. Well, my woman, she called me this morning Up on my bell telephone Completely without any warning She said she was going back home She said I'd been seen with bad women in places that weren't where I'd said She don't like the water I swim in And now she don't want me in bed Well, she nailed my heart to the kitchen door When she said she didn't want my love anymore if I'll take my life or race out and find me a brand new wife So I called her up the next evening I told her to send back my ring She said not to act without reason that you have to take care with such things She said she'd been feeling quite lonely She said that she felt quite ashamed She said that she wanted me only And she wanted things back just the same but she nailed my heart to the kitchen door When she said she didn't want my loving anymore I can't decide if I'll take my life Or race out and find me a brand new wife I found her on my doorstep next morning Her eyes were all tear-stained and red I just stood there scratching and yawning I turned round and went back to bed But she started moaning and screaming she said she'd do anything I asked So I lay back quietly dreaming All kinds of impossible tasks Cause she nailed my heart to the kitchen door When she said she didn't want my love anymore Decide if I'll take my life or race out and find me a brand new wife. But then, in my infinite pity, I got up and let her inside. She smiled through her tears and looked pretty. Why her gratitude just couldn't be denied But with a sudden 
revival of Vida. She pulled a shotgun from under her dress. She smiled as she pulled back the trigger. And she left me on the floor in a mess. Then she nailed my heart to the kitchen door and said she didn't want my loving anymore. Buried my bones in an old hollow log and scattered my vitals to be eaten by dogs. Thank you very much.